breaking. Tinumbu's two hands and legs finally badly affected after multiple surgeries. All right, my people, the news in details. Well, on to these sources. I've revealed that Ashiwajubola Tinumbu's health is failing after undergoing several surgeries in UK. It was gathered that the surgeries reportedly affected the ends and legs of the former Lagos State Governor, causing him difficulties in walking and standing properly. According to a close source, Tinumbu is in intense physiotherapy. The hands shake violently. The two ends are badly affected after several surgeries. It is also said that when taking photos, he leans on his guest or gets sandwiched to avoid the embarrassing condition of the hands. Recall that on 12th August, it was reported that President Muhammadu Buhari visited Tunumbu in London after his second surgery at the time and the pictures of him with Tunumbu holding a walking stick went viral. All right, my people, that is what it is right now. Well, on to this, there's been a lot of reactions, though. Majority of people have reacted in one way or the other. Ah, in fact, my brother, by the time you get to hear these reactions, you will be surprised at what people are saying about the situation of the former Lagos state governor, Ashua Jubola Metinumbu. All right, my people, a lot have been said. Meanwhile, according to Labo Aliero Mohammed, says, praying to God to give Tinumbu good recovery. Let us join our faith in praying for him. Well, according to Api Hassan Ishaku, says, Well, our 2023 presidential candidate by we humans but God have the final say. All right, okay. Well, I think she is trying to say our 2023 presidential candidate by we humans, okay? But God have the final say. Wish him quick recovery. All right, so this one had been said by Api Asan Ishaku. Well, according to Blessing Alonge, unto this is, well, if it is true, no gain in doing bad things. I hope our leaders will learn from this. Hmm. That is another serious one. All right, so, and then... Uh, According to Blessing Alonge on this one, she has been able to hear her mind onto this that hmm, it is not good to do bad things, so that the bad thing that Ashua Ju Bola made had done that that is what it causing his problem. Hmm, talking about Nemesis. Okay, well, hmm, well, meanwhile, according to Oluwa Tomiwa Ayibio says, well, now, nah, wow, that's the only thing he could say about that. Hmm, now, nah, wow, there is God, though. There is no gain in this world. Hmm, well, somebody is like, as far as this world is concerned, it's good to do good. Because if it is by the kind of money you have as a human being, then nobody will die. No rich man will die if it is all about money. Because I know definitely majority of people would like, oh, how much will it cost not to die? But that is where God is bigger than human being. Yeah, so when that time comes, my brother, you cannot buy it, oh. It will definitely happen. <laughs> it will happen now. All right. So that is why my people try as much as possible to do good. So that good things will continue to follow you. Okay. Well, according to something, Oshino Wall says, well, I pray he recovers because I am a Christian. Jesus teaches me to love. However, Buhari Tenumbu and their likes should know they will become story one day. Hmm. Idiami and Abacha are story even almost forgotten. Well, it is only God. Hmm. It is only good people, so to say, that last wicked people 
Hmm. <laughs> All right. So I think it's time to say, well, tyrant monster people fade away like smoke. It is not a cause. It is an established natural law that whosoever man soweth whatsoever man soweth he shall reap. Hmm. And that is it. That is it. So no one is bigger than God. Oh. Hmm. Well, quick recovery. Isha allow. This one is coming from Wahid. Well, my people, the truth of the matter has been that as far as this country is concerned, many people have you no know, caused a lot of you no know, atrocities for for majority of people simply because of their wickedness. Some simply because of some, you no, know, some of their negligence, and then at the same time, the situation of Ashua Jubola met you know, uh, uh, we are going to say, in fact, a lot of people are not happy with the situation to which he is, and then meanwhile, some set of people are still like, oh, it's nemesis that is catching up with him in the sense that. Majority of people have complained that the situation we have found ourselves right now has been because of this same man, Tinumbu. Because if not that he brought in the president, oh my God, into power, that what we have been faced with this time around hmm, wouldn't have been the way it is right now. But because of his own, uh, how will I put it, his own greed. According to what a lot of people have said, that because of his greed, he has brought in this same man, this man called Buhari. The problem we are facing today is because of you no know, the greed from Ashwaju Ahmed Tinumbu. A lot of innocent souls have died simply because of this regime APC. Hmm. Introduced by Bola Ahmed Tinumbu. And uh, you no, know, as it stands right now, majority of people are not happy and then you know if you take a look at you no know, trying listening to comments of people you will notice that some set of people are of the opinion that yes it is good for him yes so if you do good good will follow you if you do bad bad will follow him that uh bola metonumbu had done bad so far that is why god is trying to punish him right now well one thing i have actually seen to this is that eh, everybody needs to learn very well because hmm, nobody is bigger than god we can imagine the kind of money bola met in umbu as if it is all about money i'm not sure it will be in this situation that's what me i have seen so far that it will not be in this situation at least money should have been able to heal him but one thing we have now seen is that nobody is bigger than God. Hmm. So, and that is why everyone needs to learn from this. Majority of people are like, our leaders should learn from what is happening to Bola Tinumbu because as it stands right now, they should understand that there is God oh, that can fight for the masses. All right, my people, that has been it on this one. What more can we say? Me, well, let me have your take on this, my people. And remember to subscribe for more updates. Thanks and God bless.